Hello YubiTubers, it is Gizzy Greenfingers here and two weeks ago I feared for this tree's life and why was that Gizzy Greenfingers? Well, I started to get these black spots on the bark on, on some of the older branches and it was starting to die die back and the branch die back and I got very vague it was getting this weird colour and I got extremely worried and I did cut there you go there's one bit I've I've left because I, I just want to work out what is going to go on if it is going to spread or what but I did crap my pants so I did cut a lot of the branches there's another one I've cut off and it was looking really, really <clears throat> dire, to be honest. Now, it did suffer from a drought issue in June. And I'm thinking, is it was it because of that? But I did get home one day from work. <clears throat> and uh, it was because it's such a small pot. It dries up so quickly. I, I haven't learnt my lesson. And it was dry, and then it wilted again and started to lose some of the leaves. So, is it just too much stress? And that is why this has happened. There's another one I just had to cut, and it just starts dying back. You see how that just looks a different colour, but... I fed it some miracle grow. Uh, two successive weeks. And it's only now... Right, another week or a half later, but it's starting to show a bit more signs of life, and that's why I've done the video because I'm pretty certain it's going to be okay now. Um, selective branches will need to come off in the winter, but I don't want to stress it out any more than it is stressed. I just want it to grow now. So I guess we're just going to have to see what happens because I'm I haven't got a clue you don't know what branches are going to still survive or what branches are going to die it is the um it's a bit nerve wracking I think some branches still need to come off like this one I'm showing now just not happy with it Now, I know it all looks like, oh, that looks like that's got a disease, but some of it is the bark getting older, and it just looks like that, especially after it's rained, and I've got my flashlight on, and I'm recording. Um, but this will be three years old um, next month, and I've seen this in the last few years. I've seen this from when I first did it as a curtain. You get like the black bits, but the black spots that I had that I think was down to the drought, I just think it really stressed it out, and that's why the branches thought, nah, nah, sod you, I'm gonna die. But, um, some branches are gonna have to be removed because as it's, as it's growing, I'm thinking, yeah, you got got a few too many branches but the good thing about that because willows in general are prone to branches just dying for no reason it's good to have a good selection of branches so if this happens you can um you've got another one to replace that you know what i mean and it is so fast growing it, it won't take long to to sort that out now the, the crap thing about it you see where I've cut that I'm trying to get a top to this tree now and that was looking really good but because it had that it's still got a bit in that corner oh, it's still got a bit there I might get rid of that whole branch here I'm still in two minds but if you look in front it's it's growing fine so am I just worrying too much maybe 
ไม่เป็นเนี่ยฉันก็ทุกข์ทุกข์ไปเลยเพราะฉันคิดว่าอาจจะมีการตัดสินใจที่ทำให้ฉันเสียใจเมื่อมันเป็นเรื่องที่ดีที่สุดแต่ฉันไม่อยากจะเสียใจดังนั้นฉันทำทุกอย่างที่ฉันสามารถทำได้แล้วมันกลับมาจากการตัดสินใจที่ดีที่สุดแล้วฉันไม่อยากจะเสียใจดังนั้นฉันทำทุกอย่างที่ดีที่สุดแล้วมันกลับมาจากการตัดสินใจที่ดีที่สุดแล้วฉันไม่อยากจะเสียใจดังนั้นฉันทำทุกอย่างที่ Some branches are going to have to come off. Well, look at how these branches are growing. They're getting quite big now. Now that branch there, I think that needs to come off, just to give the other branches more space. See what I mean? Too much. Great. That's that's how it is. I'm not going to do it today because I don't want to stress this tree out any more than what it is stressed out. But as you can see, it's it's blooming again. I'm happy. I'm confident. I still think some branches still may die, but I'm confident the tree's gonna flourish now till October when it gets cold, and then hopefully them branches will harden up enough that they will last through the um, winter. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Gizzy Green Fingers.